My name is Matt Schilling and I am here to congratulate you on the fact that you have been chosen as one of the link leaders to welcome the class of 2024. Now over the next six or seven minutes, you are gonna be welcomed by numerous people. Myself, Dr. Brian McGill, our principal, Jen Schaffner, one of the best counselors we got, and Becky Waters, one of the other link leader advisors and math teacher extraordinaire. Now it's imperative that you watch this entire video because there's going to be some updates on what you need to expect for the future. But for right now, please enjoy. Hey, Alta Hawk Nation. Hey, this is Dr. McGill here, your principal. Uh, it's the middle of summer, but I wanted to reach out to you and just share with you a little message of positivity as we get ready to start the school year here in a little over a month crazy as that seems. Uh, we hope to be able to open school in full capacity, uh, just taking some precautionary measures. But uh, I'm here with my son, Brayden, who's also going to be a freshman. Say hi, Bray. Hello, my fellow freshmen. What's up? That's my son, Brayden. He's going to be a ninth grader. And I wanted to leave a message with you with regards to Link Crew and our orientation. So we look forward to our freshman orientation. Uh, we want you to be in attendance on that. So. Uh, anyways, enjoy freshman orientation and go leave This year's incoming class is going to need you guys more than any freshman class at Delta has ever needed someone before. Today is July 2nd, which means, hopefully, 39 days from today, we begin your training to get this freshman class ready to have the best year they possibly could have. And let's get that started by meeting the best counselor we have here at Alta High School. It's time for me to take it I'm the boss right now Not gonna fake it Now when you go down cause this Hawks. It's good to be a hawk You're gonna love it It's so good to be at Alta High So my name's Jen Scheffner I am one of the school counselors here I actually have students at the very beginning of the alphabet But I'm excited to get to know all of you so I actually am a mom of four boys. Two are already graduated from Alta, and I have two that are there currently. One is a senior and another one is a sophomore. So hopefully you'll have a chance to meet them. They're pretty awesome. Um, I'm, when I'm not at school working, I love to spend time with my family and friends, and I spend a lot of time hiking and in the outdoors. I love to bike and I love to read. So if anybody wants to talk about their most favorite book recently. I always like good book recommendations. So I hope you had a great summer. Um, I love working in the high school. I love working with the students that I work with. When I, part of the reason why I chose to be a counselor is that when I was in high school, I had some pretty tough stuff in my own personal life. And I knew what a challenging time that can be for teenagers. And I wanted to make a difference. I wanted to make a difference for people and and that's why I chose to work in a high school. So I love your energy and I love to talk to you and kind of see what your life's all about. And I am excited to get to know you this year. It's good to be an Alta Hawk. See you later, bye. Starting this Monday, July 6th, you are gonna receive weekly updates from us about what to expect at training and how to get ready for orientation. One of the most important parts of orientation is the ability to introduce yourself to a bunch of freshmen who have no idea what to expect over the upcoming year or the next four years. Let's get that started by having someone introduce themselves to you who's gonna have a huge effect on you over the next two years. Let's meet Miss Waters. When you hold me in your arms so tight, you let me know everything's all right. Um, I'm Miss Waters, and I don't normally look like I just got out of bed. I've just been sick lately. So, um, my leader introduction, I have taught at Alta High School. I just finished my 26th year. I teach math. I've taught many of you. Um, I was involved with sports for quite a few years and then student government. And then um, Mr. McGill came and asked me if I would help with a new program called Link Crew. And 
it's an amazing program, so I was so excited to get to help with that. Um, I grew up in Oregon and Arizona, so I am not a native Utah. Um, let's see, I love to cook, I love traveling, um, I love animals, I've got three cats and a dog. So, yeah, I look forward to getting to know you all better. You will love Mr. Schilling and Jen. They are so much fun to work with. And I look forward to um, seeing the lives that you guys can touch this year. So, have a great rest of the summer. Bye. us get this incoming freshman class ready to attend ELTA this year. Now, I've been in education just as long as Ms. Waters. This is my 26th year in education, except for this is my fifth state. I've taught in New York, Virginia, North Carolina, Maryland, and now Utah for the last six years. There's some things you can kind of define me by. One of them is my tattoos. I have two of them, working on a third one. The one here is for my boys, and we'll get to that in a second about me being a dad. The other one's on my ankle. That's a shark, that's because I'm a swimmer. I was a swimmer all the way through college. You probably saw that earlier in the video. I'm a teacher. Um, I have taught a bunch of different things in social studies. I actually started off in special ed. Um, I taught that for the first four years and then got into social studies and finally into government. I have a master's degree in political science and government is kind of what I kind of define myself educationally. How I define myself as a person is I'm, I'm a husband. I couldn't be married to the better woman. Um, Emily is amazing. She makes me happy every single day and I cannot tell you how excited and happy I am that I can say that I am her husband. I'm really into music, but not necessarily listening to music. I love going to concerts. If you have the opportunity, check in, stop in my room, take a look up in the wall and take a look at all the concerts I have been to. I cannot tell you how excited I am that when she finally comes, I get to go see Cher. Um, Concerts for me are everything. I really love going to see people play um, in a setting that, that other people can't say they've seen before. Finally, I'm a dad. Um, that's not even a finally. I am a dad to two of the best kids out there. Uh, Spencer is my older son. He is 13. Zachary is my younger son. He is nine. Spencer's a baseball player. And Zach is a swimmer, oh, which makes me so happy. Um, I am so excited that you're going to be joining us this year, and I can't wait for you to get to know me a little bit better. But for now, um, let's take the next step. Let's jump in and see what your assignment is over the coming next week about what you got to do so I and everybody else involved get to know you guys. Okay, now that you know all of us, there's an opportunity for us to get to know all of you guys. So here's the assignment. Attached to the email you got in a PDF format, is a form that describes what a leader introduction is. We need you to make a leader introduction so we have an opportunity to get to know you guys better. Now this leader introduction, this video that you need to make, has to be sent to me either through CSD Docs or through my email by July 9th. It's Matthew, M-A-T-T-H-E-W, dot Schilling, S-C-H-I-L-L-I-N-G, Right, And this video has to have four components. Four, number one, it has to be personable. Two, meaningful. Three, genuine. And four, relatable. This is going to give us an opportunity to get to know you guys and more importantly, for you guys to get to know each other because I'm going to compile this into a kind of a, a little bit shorter of a video. I can't wait to meet you guys. I look so forward to finding out things about you. And I, um, I will see you on Monday. Shield Dog out.